Now, if you've been to a shopping centre in recent weeks, you won't be able to miss the fact that Christmas is only a few weeks away now. The battle for festive shoppers is well and truly underway, but one major TV advert has sparked a sexism row. Three, two, one! Let's have a row! Tis the season, the season for Christmas advertising. This time every year we're bombarded by retailers telling us why we should shop with them for our festive treats. But this year, Asda has come under fire for its TV advert. Wake up! It's Christmas! It doesn't just happen by magic. Behind every great Christmas, there's Mum. And behind Mum, there's Asda. What's for tea, love? It sparked numerous complaints of the Advertising Standards Authority and a Twitter storm, with many saying it's unfair to both men and women. So is Asda's image of Christmas outdated? Let's find out, shall we? I'm joined now by the feminist writer and campaigner Kate Smurthwaite and branding expert and regular on this programme as well, Jonathan Gabay joins me too now. Thanks very much, both of you, for your time tonight. Uh, Kate, let's start with you. What did you make of the advert? Is it sexist in your opinion? Well, absolutely. There are two problems with the advert. The first one is it has this message that says, behind every great Christmas, there's mum. And that's a bit rude, actually, to all the brilliant single dads, stay-at-home dads, for the stepdads, the foster dads, the grandmas, the, all these other amazing people who put so much effort into raising children it's quite rude to them so to be to behind single sex most couples great, sort of thing usually there is a good woman behind a good christmas quite a lot of there? the time this might be a realistic thing but then it's quite worrying the message they're sending out to these women because they're saying the magic doesn't happen on its own and the message seemed to be that if you are a mum it's your job on your own to achieve magical Christmas not just good Christmas or nice Christmas but magical which means beyond the realm of normally normally humanly possible and, and it, if they were having a message for those women wouldn't it be much better if the message could be hey you know what Boxing Day let's give it a day it, off. That's isn't, a day off. Isn't there a, isn't there a break? Maybe that's set people? to come. Well that's going to be that, that Kate would that probably be, be the, the follow-up advert. What do you think what I, 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 think that you're, I think that you're making such a lot of fuss about this fighting over who cooks the turkey. I mean, that's really what you're talking about here. But it's not. The advert is cooking mm. the turkey, it's getting the tree, it's wrapping the presents, well, it's buying the that presents. Is, that is a great... If you think this is a trivial job, Jonathan, then I... No, I'm no, no, I'm sorry. I'm s uh, no, I, I think that actually... James <laughs> actually dropped his mic. Uh, no, it's OK. Don't don't no, actually, I think it's showing that the mum here in this advert is very stoic. I mean, the, the woman is actually doing so much stuff. I think it's a celebration of mum. Actually. Well, then it should be saying, let's give her a bit more reward for I'm that. Sure they, I'm, I'm sure they will the next day when it comes to, to Boxing Day. It's a little old-fashioned, though, Jonathan, isn't it? I mean, come on, I don't know what happens in your household, but it is a little bit old, and she's also looking beautiful as well at the end, which is typical, isn't it? Well, the thing is, is that it's very realistic, actually. It's not just... It's you not think about, this advert's no, realistic? I'll tell you why it's realistic. I'll tell you <laughs> what, the colour of that turkey. Give, you come right round my house on Christmas Day, it's pink at one end, black at the other. Okay, okay, okay. I'll tell you why it's realistic. It's realistic, OK? Because, unfortunately, and I do under, underline the word underline okay unfortunately there are too many mums who are left to do everything like this and it, it is wrong and so I think it's a true reflection on society. But exactly, but what they're doing is they're romanticising this. You accept it's wrong, I accept it. I don't it's think wrong, that that lady looks... But I think it totally romanticises it. Where's really? the bit at the end where she sits down and goes, well, it wasn't that magic for me? <laughs> oh, and well, the she's the not going to say that, well. is she? She's not going to yeah. say, it wasn't that magic for me. Mind you, it was Asda. I Jonathan, mean, she's not going to say that, is she? Jonathan, how much money will Asda have spent researching this? Because they won't have done this by half, will they? They would not have done this by half, and they've actually had quite a lot of surveys in this in into, into the thousands of people in terms of focus groups and stuff like that and they have all come back saying we approve of this including well, on the facebook including on the facebook they got over 22,000 mm. approvals so Kate, you know, but I'm not is, sure. But the thing is, they've obviously found a target market and they've said, yeah, these people love it. What they haven't done is checked whether or not there's another group of people, me included, the oh. gay parents, all those people, who are going, actually, not only do we not like it, we're really quite angry And about just very it. briefly, Kate, I have to say, as they have been in touch, they said they apologise if, yeah. you know, there was any bad feeling thought. It's meant to be light-hearted. It's all it about is. Christmas, isn't oh, it? Oh, well, and sexism's always funny, isn't it? It's hilarious. Um, it's one of these things oh, where... Oh, for goodness where we sake. Get, we, get it, we get a little we bit every day, isn't it? There. Kate, much do about nothing, I'm afraid. Oh, I'm going to leave you two to carry on. <laughs> Thank you very much, Jonathan and Kate. Thank Thanks very much. much for your thoughts tonight.